Hello everyone, uh, I'm here today to do a review of uh, Trick of Worker by Alan Garner and this is also part of the long list of the Booker 2022 um, and this is a very weird book um, it's really 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 short um, people say that uh, small things like this is the shortest book to be nominated but to me this one felt shorter uh, maybe it's because it has um, short chapters and it just reads faster I don't know but uh, this is really short um, and it's a wild book I'm not sure anyone that has read it kind of exactly knows what's happening in it um, it's basically um, about this boy Joe who meets a uh, trickle walker which is kind of a um, fantasy figure kind of person and they go into this um, this trip together um, that's basically it um, it's very uh, it's told in a very whimsical way it has um, a lot of folklore elements and I probably didn't get all of them because I'm not from the UK so I don't um, I'm not as familiar with that kind of folklore uh, and probably if you are from the UK you get more from the book uh, but I I thought that was um, you can enjoy this book without knowing all of those folklore elements but it does have a very whimsical tone to it uh, people have compared it to Lani by Max Porter and when I read the description I thought that sounded like Lani but actually to me it reads more like something more nonsensical something like Alice in Wonderland or something like that it just has this kind of rhythmical tone to it like a, like a children's riddle and, um, but with that nonsensical element that you don't really know exactly what's going on and you might not um, understand what's going on in the book I don't think I fully understood what was going on but you can still enjoy it because that's not the point of the book the plot and what happens is not the point of the book it's the the whimsy and the um, crazy things that are going on and just going from one side to the other that's the whole point of the book and because it's so short I think it works I think if, if it was any longer it might become jarring to to do that and read a two three hundred page book um, where you don't know what's going on might not be as enjoyable but this is a uh, like I think less than a hundred pages in some editions so it's really short uh, and you just go with it like I think that's the general consensus of people that have read it uh, you just go with it and just enjoy the ride um, and for me it it did it, it was enjoyable um, if you really need a plot that makes sense this is completely not for you but if you just want to go there for the craziness I think it's a good book to take uh, to pick up and it's not as I said it's not very long um, so I read it um, in a couple of hours so yeah it, it's not it's not a big commitment and it, it just it was just fun um, it's not normally what uh, the booker chooses in their list I think uh, but it was a refreshing thing to throw in that list and I enjoyed it um, let me know if you have read it if you also enjoyed it and the next video. Bye!